Hey YouTube, this is Dito. I'm back with another one. So I'm gonna just start the video by saying this. You know, some people just don't know when to stop. I mean, they honestly don't. They don't know when to stop. So this this article come from NBC4.com. So apparently, y'all, we got another uh a lawsuit going on when it comes to the abdominal meter. So Fourth Ohio user car dealership sued for a domino video bow bag. And this make back the fourth, or excuse me, maybe between the fourth or fourth or fifth video I have done about these lawsuits going on about the abdominal video. I don't know what's I don't know what's wrong with people. I really don't know what's wrong with them. But this is this is starting to get out of control. But there's a video to this offer that I want y'all to see. My Attorney General Dave Yost is suing a fourth Columbus used car company dealership. He said was rolling back odometers and selling them under false pretenses. The lawsuit is against Ohio Mega Group. It alleges that the dealership is in violation of the Ohio Consumer Sales Practices Act and the Odometer Rollback and Disclosure Act. An investigation revealed that the dealership shares a lot with S Automotive, one of four used car dealerships previously sued for similar violations, along with Kalengo Links, after the two received nearly 60 complaints about alleged odometer tampering schemes in February. For more on this lawsuit, just go to NBC4i.com. Running a business comes to. Oh, you heard the video. You know what? Like I said, people just don't know when to quit. They don't know when to quit at all. So Ohio Attorney uh, General Davis Yost is suing a fourth Columbia user car company dealership. He said was rolling back a dominant meter and selling them under fall features. Lawsuit against Ohio Mega Group, formerly located in the Eastern Main Street, at and its owner Dominican Whaley. Lawsuit alleged the dealership is a violation of Ohio Consumer Sale Practice Act and the Dominant Rollback Disclosure Act. An investigation revealed that dealership share, share a lot of S Automotive, one of four user car dealership people sued for a similar violation, along with a catalog link after two received nearly 60 complaints about the alleged Dominant Media Tapping Scheme in February. Early this summer, Uncle B. Alder and its owner, Bethan Ezekiel, were sued for reportedly violating multiple consumer protection laws. What's wrong with all of you? This suit against Ohio Mega Group 5 in Franklin County, common pleas, uh, the Pleas Court accused the dealership of Wally of. Failing to promote file title application within 30 to 40 days of the vehicle assignment delivered, concealing the uh, rebuilt savage status, status, excuse me, rebuilding savage status of the vehicle from consumers, falsifying a, a dominator closer statement, withholding a, a QA and complete a dominant meter disclosure, engaging in a dominant tampering and alteration. Failing to obtain the suit of, of beyond in a amount not less than twenty five thousand, selling a used motor vehicle to use consumer from location that was not Ohio Mega Group established case of business. The lawsuit seek a uh, restriction for anyone who bought the vehicle from Ohio Mega Group and recover of uh, funds from the title defect. The session fund that was paid out to resolve consumer complaint. You know what? Going back to my point earlier, like I said, even buying a used car is not cheap. So the fact, uh, unfortunately, people is still being a victim of this, uh, or this type of, uh, Calling and don't make no sense. I mean, 
This is where you can't. Y'all about to tell me what y'all think that it's a problem that I put Nathan's off the scripture. This is why, yeah, this is why when you try, on average, when you try to uh, just make a simple purchase, like uh, buying a used car or buying like a, it's about anything. This say anything. When you buy anything in general and you got to deal with stepping stones like this, it's just not right. You know what I'm saying? It's just not right. It, it, it's not right and it's really uncalled for. And it's going to take people who try to buy these cars, take them all, take them to do all this vomit. Take, do, take them people do all these, uh, uh, I, 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 you know what? I, I'm kind of speechless a little bit because you know what? You would think, and this for me, you would think this stuff would be going on that much. But the fact that it is, is just, it's it just not right. It really is. It's, it's not right at all. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this in the comment section. Be sure to subscribe if you enjoy videos like this. Because I make these type of content on the web. Be sure to like the video. Share the video. And I'll see y'all in my next one. Below out.